Hey, welcome back. We are building a mobile bubble tea shop today, which is fabulous because you can't have enough bubble tea shops, let alone them being mobile. So you can actually physically get them on every street corner. Do that. I would be so happy to have bubble tea on every street corner to feed my addiction. However, I will mention that I've loved bubble tea back before it was bubble tea, back when it was known as boba. So does that make me an OG fan when we had to go searching for it down like little streets and alleyways in the... <laughs> anyway. Oh my gosh. There are 109 pieces in here. It's $16 in Australia. Go to Kmart. You'll get it cheaper. <laughs> I hope Kmart always stays cheaper because otherwise I will die. Not literally, but I'll be super, super sad. So we've got such cute little kawaii style boba stickers. Got our instruction book. And we've got two characters in here, which is such great value for such a little set. So let's have a look at them. First up, we've got Nova. Nova is wearing some little black loafers. I don't even know if you call them loafers now. They're possibly... I don't know. We used to call them loafers. Does that just make me old? Also, due to the fact that I look at her pants and I go, mum jeans. But I do love this new pants mold for 2023. Her shirt's got a new print on it. It's like a singlety kind of thing over a mesh, over a mesh undershirt. Got a necklace with stars on it. And the big logo-y thing on it is the same as what's on her mobile phone, which we'll look at in a moment, but it's the same one that was in her room. So she's, it's a game. It's a game, like a mobile game that... All the cool kids apart, like Sadie, apparently playing. Okay, face and hair, same as we've seen in the previous sets, but here's that mobile phone. Look, oh, no, they're both, I was going to say one of them's happy and one of them's grumpy, but no, they're both grumpy little squishy yellow alien creatures. I really want to know what this game is. But the big winner here is the actual, I mean, it's just a cylinder with dots printed on it, but I'm so excited to have actual boba bubble tea in Lego form! How cute is that with cream and mm, yums on the top? So she's not alone in this set. She's, we've also got Mathilde in here and Mathilde with this name. She's got to be French. So she attends the international school. She's got silver shoes and oh, the light creamy green skirt as part of the bottom part of her apron. I just, I love the fact that our aprons now for mini dolls are the same colour on the top and the bottom, which is realistic and normal, not the weird thing that we had before where these the torso and the base didn't match. It was just odd. Anyway, cute. Very, very cute boba tea uniform. Matilde has got some very quizzical looking eyebrows going on. Very cute. And she's got this hairpiece in yellow, so she's a bit stylish. Once again, that also makes me think that she's French. I'm wondering if we've actually heard her, her voice, her accent in the episodes that we've had, but I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, two characters. Let's move them over and start the actual building component of the set. So this looks like it's a little table, but I think it's actually a high stool to sit at the bench that's going to be out the front of the bubble mobile bubble tea shop. And this is so cute. This is a little figure, the figure you put out the front of the tea shop. I need to stop saying mobile tea shop. Hey, look, he's got his arms up in the air. So let's make him happy. I mean, he's super happy to be bubble tea because how if you were bubble tea, your life would be perfect. So on this side here, we've got the price list. So you've got $3 for the boba tea without the white squealy deliciousness on the top and $4 for added white squishy deliciousness. And on the front is the very kawaii print with the bub boba, boba bubbles down the bottom. Happy little kawaii face. Look at him. He's just a happy his little bubble tea figure. See-through part for the top of the cup. The top part of the cup that doesn't have any liquid in it. The sad part of the cup. That was probably filled with ice up there. And a straw. How cute is that? <laughs> and the correct answer is the cutest thing you have seen all day. Thank you. Okay. So this shop is supposed to be mobile. What makes it mobile? The fact that there's this little pink scooter included and the pink scooter is actually electric because all of the vehicles of the Lego friends are now electric. I have no idea how this teeny tiny scooter is going to be. He's going to have enough juice. Ha! He's going to need some boba tea to actually pull this shop. But let's... Well, you know, let's just suspend our disbelief anyway. We've got a helmet here for Matilde to be actually driving the scooter. So she's extra super safe, but it's a helmet with no hair. So it just looks odd. I'm glad to see we are getting more helmets with hair. So hopefully we'll be able to change over one in the future and give her a helmet with hair to add to this. Okay, on to the actual bubble tea shop. Bubble tea mobile bubble tea shop. Yep, <laughs> bubble tea mobile, mobile tea shop. 
definitely broken. I'm broken. So tired, but I could never be tired of you, Lego. And I could never be tired of Bubbles here either. Though I'm tired of saying it, so <laughs> I'm going to try and stop. <laughs> okay, so there's actually a very, very small amount of floor plan in this or actual usable standable space. So that bit in the middle is all you need to actually get a character inside it. And I mean, it's got to be small, right? Because it's going to be honked around by the scooter. You don't want it to be too cumbersome. Otherwise, it's not mobile. Can't possibly be mobile, though. I'm still questioning, obviously, the mobility of this with an electric scooter. But anyway, so this part here is a little shelf with a little you know, countery bit for putting out the stuff once the customer has bought it. And this is a door, obviously. I mean, it could have been a window, but it's actually a door. How cute are the stickers in this set? I mean, they are just perfectly kawaii, even down to the colours. Are there specific kawaii colours? I suppose so. The sticker sheet is just, you look at it and go, it's so cute, it's so kawaii. <laughs> The whole thing about this is just adorable. So we've basically got the, the nuts of this together. It's, it's, it's as big as it's going to get. It just needs a little bit over the top and it needs the wheels. Otherwise, I'm harping on about this mobility bit. But without wheels, it ain't going nowhere. Okay, so let's get these wheels on. Yep, yeah, there's only one way we can put these wheels on. So that's good. I can't get it wrong. Some, some of the wheels have got like holes in either side. So just need to make sure I get them on the right way around. And it gets a little archy bit over the back. Like this is like the tiniest horse trailer in shape. The teeniest, tiniest horse trailer that sells bubble tea. So this bit here goes here. So we're starting to deck out the actual mechanisms of the bubble tea making stuff for the inside so this is a bowl full of scoops or like not not sprinkles not it's it's the, the bottom bit so all the num num jellies all the pearls nums so they're down here on that little pallet there and we've got a hook there where we can add a spoon for scooping just one because we're definitely going to be cross contaminating these but it doesn't matter does not matter in the Lego world. On the front, we've got our hook there to attach the scooter to, rounding over this end, which is going to be the front. Here's our one spoon to rule all the toppings. And there's our little thing for checking out, little card reader. And then we've got some of the toppings just attached here. So the swirls are attached to the wall, got some strawberry attached to the wall. You just kind of Ping them off the wall when you want to add them to your delicious, delicious tea. And a couple of more stickers just to add decoration to the inside wall. Not the outside wall, though that would be cute too. But on the inside wall here of the shop. So that goes on like that. And that actually flips open so that you've got more access to the inside of this to get your to get your mini doll in and out. Otherwise, it would be impossible. Well, not, not technically impossible, but it would be very, very, very fiddly. Got a second bubble tea little container here. So everyone, well, the two characters in here can have bubble tea. It's got a squirty top on it. So is that so you can add your own pearls? Like a squirty add pearl? No, it's just a tiny, it's one with a straw. Oh, I'm so silly. Yeah, okay, so that's a boba tea with the straw. Whereas the one that Nova's got is the one with the delicious fl floofy cream stuff on the top. Okay, so we have got, <laughs> I get so confused. We've got our really, really cute mobile bubble tea shop ready to rumble or to give you delicious yummy drinks with pearls in them. See, see what I mean? It is, it's still fiddly to try and get a character in here. So I'm glad that you've got that openable bit there because the door's just there for show. If you open the door and try and shove them in through there, it'll just be Rafferty's rules. They'll be in there any which way. So how cute, how cute is this? I will repeat the cutest thing you've seen all day. <laughs> it really is, look at that. <laughs> and you've got the high stool so you can sit there at that little front bench section. Uh, and we're all done. We've got our mobile bubble tea shop ready for all your nom nom bubble tea needs. Oh, I wonder where my closest bubble tea shop is. There's not one on the corner of my street, which makes me very angry. I'm going to go and live in Heart Lake City because they've got things right. So let me know what you think of this set. It's a really cute little impulse purchase one. And yeah, I, you just can't go wrong with this set, I think. Unless you hate boba tea and then what are you even doing with your life? Really, take a good hard look at yourself. <laughs> All right, I will be back with more videos really, really soon. In the meantime, I'm just going to enjoy this little set because it's really adorable. <laughs> See you soon. Bye.